Hello, I'm Bill Little, a plastic surgeon in Washington, D.C. My co-author is Morris Hartstein, an oculoplastic surgeon in Tel Aviv. Together we present in the June edition of the Aesthetic Journal our technique for routine lower lid blepharoplasty, which we call orbicularis hitch. As the name implies, its focus is almost entirely on muscle elevation. Skin is removed, sometimes in large amounts, but only to accommodate the muscle suspension. While many authors have advocated orbicularis suspension as a component of blepharoplasty for many years now, our approach presents key differences. Our suspension represents a purely vertical imbrication of the intact muscle sheet that avoids its incision, division, or denervation, while it also avoids tension. The preceptal muscle is simply elevated and fixed to the lateral orbital rim periosteum, allowing redundant muscle to redistribute itself higher in the lid, bringing some extra volume as well. Certain advantages follow. Skin excision is planned and marked preoperatively, speeding interoperative execution. When significant muscle descent has occurred, large amounts of skin can be safely removed, up to 20 millimeters in our series. The lateral canthus is supported without the need for canthal manipulation or alteration. Orbital invasion is limited to a three-snip scissors dissection superficial to the lateral rim periosteum performed through a small buttonhole spread through the muscle coat with no further dissection or release from orbital structures, even when the hitch approaches 20 millimeters. The technique accommodates multiple approaches to suborbital volumization, including fat sharing and fat grafting. And there is no undermine component of the lid remaining after closure, allowing the skin resurfacing of choice to the entire lid. Our key technical principle remains the avoidance of tension during the preoperative test for muscle elevation and markings, as well as, of course, the operation itself. Together, Morris and I invite your evaluation of what we consider a safe, simple, and by the way, rapid approach to lower blepharoplasty.